this is what it's all about. Welcome to Storm Kathleen. How epic is this? To be honest, I wasn't planning on filming a video this weekend, but when you get conditions like this, you can't not do really. Uh, I haven't brought my actual camera gear with me this weekend, so I'm going to try and bod something with the action cam that you're on now, uh, and I've got my phone. I'll see what I can cobble together with those. I also thought it was a good opportunity to have a test of the anonometer that I bought on Amazon last week. You might have saw a, a post that I put on. Have a test between what the forecast is saying. Currently, BBC, BBC is saying this is about 50 mile an hour. Interestingly windy, he's having it more like 30, 35. Uh, I thought we'd test what the anonometer readings are and sort of calibrate that against the, the forecast. But yeah, this is spectacular. Right, I think what we're going to do, we're going to head up onto headland, give this an anometer proper test. Then I think we'll come back down to the beach later on when the tide's out, try and get a few floaters, maybe run a time map, something like that. At the minute, obviously we can't get on, the tide's well up. So yeah, I think we'll bob back here a bit later on in the afternoon. meter out.
I've no idea what brand that is. Proster, no idea. 15 quid on Amazon. All right, turn that on. Plane's coming that way. Right. Well, interestingly, you can see that. That's saying 21 mile an hour, which is more in keeping with what the BBC was at, uh, with what Windy was saying, which was 30, 31. Let's point it directly into the wind. That's saying 18, 19. 21, 22, and the gusts. There you go. Not, not certainly not 50. Now, I don't know how accurate this thing is. But, I suppose what he's telling me. Well, when he's saying 30, he's saying 20, do I have 10 mile an hour on? This is what 30 mile an hour feels like. St. Tuddles Island. And Bear Grylls lives on there. That's his lighthouse. Oh. Definitely saying 20 mile an hour. I think what I'll do. I'll keep this in my pocket and take a few more readings as we're walking back. Yeah, that's peaked out at 22, 23, 23. 29. Yeah, so I think I would say that this is exactly what uh, Wendy was saying. I've absolutely no idea whether you can hear me or not. This <laughs> is absolutely bonkers. What a morning, what an absolute gorgeous morning. Look at the waves. Ah, oh, look at that. This is why I should always have my camera gear in my bag. Gutted. Oh, man. Right, I'm going to call that do for the time being, and then we'll come back later on, try and get down the beach, take a few forces. Just got a short time match running. Wind speed's not too bad to be fair at the minute. Well, we are in quite a sheltered little spot, we've just descended down the stairs. I don't think we've got anything there other than wet feet. I haven't really got the right camera gear. I've only got my small Sony compact camera. I haven't really got a long enough lens. 